y'all now. In case you haven't heard, honey, Bell Collective is back for season five. And honey, we have its star and my good friend, Miss Tamara Cherie, here to dish all about it. Welcome, Tamara. Hi. It feels good to be back. I okay. miss you guys. We missed you mm -hmm. too, girl. Mm -hmm. Well, honey, the new season of Bell Collective is out now. Mm -hmm. What can the audience expect to see from you and the ladies? Oh, my goodness. This season, when I tell you guys, you're going to see, like, new personalities. Ooh. From the same people? From the same people. Oh, wow. <laughs> from the same people, same cast. Okay. They just brought new personalities this oh. season, but no, yes, this season is really about, like, I guess, reconnecting. Okay. A lot of forgiveness Good. is definitely mm -hmm. needed this season, mm -hmm. yes, and just trying to mend the relationships okay. of the bells. Well, are you going to reconnect with Marie? We're <laughs> continue to watch season five. Yeah. <laughs> I am a work in progress. Oh. Well, girl, you and Gary are really close. Now, has Gary ever shaded you about something that you've done or said on the show? And if so, girl, what? Oh, my goodness. He definitely will call. Of course. As he's watching. Yeah. <laughs> as he's at watching. At the same time. <laughs> at the same time. Mm -hmm. But shaded me. No, he's really good at shading the girls, though. <laughs> I'm trying to think, what is he doing? I did to a shade little me? shade, maybe, today. To oh, oh. <laughs> today? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, today. I told you sometimes it's your own friends. Yep. Sometimes your own friends, because you're yep. good at shading the girls all day long. Yeah. Now, Brad, you and I usually watch reality shows. Why don't you watch when I watch I, it? I don't, I, I can't. I, it, it's a lot. I have a, a kid now. I can't. <laughs> that's yeah. crazy. You know, that's going to be your excuse for the next 18 years. I've been using the hell out of it for like a <laughs> time. It works because it. it's done. <laughs> Baby, yes, the baby. Brad, you guys, you I'll talk about it. Hey, Brad, did you watch this? So, yeah. So, and you yeah, called yeah. doing the commercial. Yeah, I always call you he, during commercial. He okay, girl, what is going on? Yeah, here, huh? he's, yeah, you, you have your, um, who you're not feeling. Yeah, so, but I mean, overall, I like the show. Ooh. I like the show, though, so, you know, but anyway. And I don't, it's okay if you don't like some of the girls. I understand. Because mm -hmm, you don't <laughs> like them neither. Okay. <laughs> But anyway, Tam, now you wrote a motivational book, honey, a while back. But, honey, most people like to spill tea, honey, in their books. Mm -hmm. Now, would you ever do a tell-all book, and Ooh. who would you tell on? Oh, my goodness, a tell-all book. I don't think, you know, because I love this industry so much. Mm -hmm. I love entertainment. I, I don't think I would tell all <laughs> because okay. I love okay. life. I, I, I really do. So I don't think I would tell all. I'll tell some. What is this book about? Actually, my book was Surrounded by Sin, Grounded by Love. Okay, okay. so that the title itself actually comes from the entertainment industry. Okay. Just being surrounded by so much sin, mm -hmm. but I was yeah. always grounded by love. Okay. okay. So, yeah, so, you know, look, we see a lot in entertainment business. You oh, guys yeah. know, don't sit up here in front oh, now. Yes, we, yeah. So, we know you have a ton of things going on, and out of all the stuff you have going on, what are you most excited about right now in your career? Oh, my, my career? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I, I definitely enjoy everything that I'm doing right now. I love the podcast that I'm doing. There, I said it. I love mm -hmm. that. I love that. But, okay, so you guys know... I did, um, I have my own immunity tea, right? Okay. Yes, I have, just in case you did not know. Okay. I have my own immunity tea. So did you put some so Ozempic in it? No, uh -oh. no Ozempic. How do you put Ozempic <laughs> in tea? How do you put Ozempic <laughs> in tea, <laughs> Gary? Uh -oh. No, it's not, not Ozempic tea. No. <laughs> Let me know when you make that. We yeah, all get exactly. rich. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to take the shot anymore. Okay. Like, no. You just drink no. the Ozempic. <laughs> right. Since she's dished with us so many times, we're going to have her come and chime in on this tea we got right here now. Uh, Cat Williams just added another enemy to his list, and this time it's SNL. He said he's the only person that has been parodied nine times but never invited to the show. <laughs> and he didn't stop there. Check this out. A lot of times when people are doing an impression of you, they're really showing you how they feel about you. Mm. You know what I mean? So for a Saturday Night Live to have an impression of me and have a woman do that means they think I'm a what do y'all think about Cat Williams' thoughts on this? Because, uh, you know, Keenan Thompson can't play everybody. Right, exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, he's good. But I, didn't, you know, I, I don't didn't know if you can pull it. up Cat Williams. Uh, I don't think that's what it would mean, though. I think that that was the best person. If they thought that was the best person and that person exactly. did the role the best, mm. then that's who they were going to get to do and it. Ego the world is a monster yeah, on that I show. She could do a little bit of everybody on oh, okay. yeah. I don't want him to be mad at that if it was if it was a good in person. Did they say something bad? It was pretty much a recreation of the Club Shay Shay mm -hmm. interview. So oh, the only yeah. other qualified oh, that's black her. man. Yes, yeah. that's her. You thought that was that's her? her. Uh, come on, <laughs> she's that good. Yeah. 
I wasn't <laughs> even really like paying attention. Yeah, that's okay, hard. now I see it. Okay. I don't know. I think it's more to it. Maybe it's because he hasn't been on there yet. I, yeah, he's got to feel <laughs> a certain way about that. It. Yeah, because yeah. they're always impersonating him and all of these things. Maybe it's because he's just not, he hasn't been on there himself. Come on, Lauren, do the right thing, man. Yes. Invite, invite the cat on, man. That part. Well, y'all, that's all the tea we have for today. Everybody, be sure to check out Tamara Cherie every Friday on Bell Collective, airing on OWN. Hey, don't forget to hit us up on social media. We're on all these platforms at Dish Nation. We'll see you there.